One of the techniques you'll hear mentioned in audiovisual is the third image. Now that can be quite difficult to create. It's when one image fades into another and for a brief moment a third is created. In the digital age we can take two images like this one and this one into an image editor and we can help them along to create the third image and physically place a third image in the middle so in some respects it becomes the second image but you can see what I mean if I had a, an amalgamation of both of these and we had it sitting in the middle we could fade from this one gently through the third image onto this one well we can do that to some degree with masks a little bit of trial and error but worth having a go so let's select this image go to the objects and animation screen and we'll apply a mask but here we're going to apply a mask in the form of an image and this is where the experimentation comes into play perhaps we could select this one straight away and there you can see the boat is beginning to show through but down in the mask content let's have a look at right clicking and added adding an image but we'll add the same image now when we add the same image we get almost a ghost of the third and we've also got the opportunity if we want to to switch to the animation tab and adjust the color correction with regard to brightness and contrast if it's necessary to do that but now when I come out of the object and animation screen I can drag another copy of this down because now I've got my third image we've got this image which is going to go from this one to this one through this one now normally when we do that we would be taking some care in the timeline with the fades of the images so let's say this image comes on over three seconds it's on screen for just a couple of seconds and then this one comes on over four but then we sort of bring this one as close as we dare and maybe give that three or four let's take a look at that in the mini player let me make that a little bit bigger so we can see it here and we'll press play there's our blank there's the first of the three as normal but now we've got that gentle fade on of the third image we've got that little ghost in the background which just holds for a moment and then the third image actually takes the second one off the screen it seems a little bit odd doesn't it referring to this as the third image because it now becomes the second image in the digital age but of course if this doesn't work we've got the opportunity to go back into the objects and animation screen and adjust these we can try different images and quite often you'll stumble across a really great effect that would have taken quite a bit of time to create in Photoshop or Photoshop elements now with the spinning round of the screen there's a slight difference appearing here because I've changed the mask stencil and I've included the rock face so in actual fact we can now move from the three girls at the fence here to the boat on the foreshore but we're going through even a third image which is the rock face as well as an amalgamation of these two so let me just put my cursor there to finish and we'll just watch as it fades gently through the texture as you can see coming through from the rock how long that remains on screen of course is a personal choice